Bahamas, Tyrone Concliffe, Bahamas, Brandon Leacock, Trinidad and Tobago, Dimitri Myers, the 3,500 champion, Belize looking for the triple, Javon Roberts, Guyana, and Adriel Mitchell, Grenada. Short end of Myers' range, 908.5 last night to win the 3,000 meters, won the 1,500 meters as well with a, a sharp looking last lap, caught two-time Olympic 1500 meter champion Sebastian Coe, the president of World Athletics, uh, paying attention to him, young boy in the blue on the left-hand side, 148. And uh, can he do the triple? That's the question. Yeah, also in this field, Javon Roberts, Guyana, Adriel Mitchell, Grenada, Zaya Henfield, Bahamas, Bailey of Aruba, Carlos Bryson Keynes, St. Martin, Dylan Marin, Martinique, 13 competitors, Rashid Price, Jamaica, with 13, they may well have had a qualifying round, but they decided to come to a straight final as they are sent on their way. 800 final for under 17 boys. Grenada's Keylor and Moses goes out quickly and strikes the front with the Bohemian. Looks like Concliffe, who has gone into second position. Harry, Morin, Monal, and Roberts last year, fifth, sixth, and eighth. And uh, of course, Roberts didn't finish last year's race. The 1500, 3000 champion struggling at the back. Toughest event for him of the three as the Grenadian leads this 800 meters final with Tyrone Concliffe of the Bahamas in second position. 56-1 for the first lap. Delana Todd of Jamaica in third, the Trimbaconian Leacock in fourth position with the second Jamaican in fifth position at this stage. Todd of Jamaica now to the front. Right Leacock of second. Trinidad and Tobago makes a move as well. Price in second. Normally a good tactician. Ton of Jamaica has the lead. Price of Jamaica in second. Leacock of Trinidad and Tobago holding the bronze medal position at this stage. The Guyanese is dangerous. The poise Javon Roberts as well. Down the home stretch they come. Rashidi. Price left back and now Roberts strikes the front. Javon Roberts wins gold for Guyana in the under 17 boys. 800 meters, the Trinidadian Lee Cup snatches the bronze medal as well. Told you Javon Roberts would be dangerous. Left it late, timed his run to perfection and strikes gold in 156.64. Didn't finish last year, but no one top. A flying last 100 meters circles the leaders and gives him a clear and singular hold on the gold medal. Wonderful last 100 for Roberts of Guyana. Hang off the pace for most of it. And then produced a storming finish. Came in here with a 157, two clocking. Goes faster on the big stage. Strikes Karifta Gold. Tremendous finish by Roberts. In their history, Ian Roberts. And then at 800 meters for Guyana. And here. A new man carrying the mantle, second from the right hand side in the picture, easing past the rivals on the back straight away. Tops into the inside curve as they run around this area, past the discus area, and into the straightaway for the last time. Trips up his feet a little bit, but then finds clear running room, and once he sees home, goes into lane number two, flies past Price. Tracks down Price's teammate and flies home by himself 
in command to celebrate our famous victory at Karifta. Javon Roberts, the gold medalist, Tonda of Jamaica, the silver medalist, and Leacock of Trinidad and Tobago leaned in for the bronze. Shot put on the 20 boys final. The Jamaican Kobe Lawrence going for a double double. Yes. Double champion last year. Discus shot put has already won the discus here. This is his strong event. He's a shot put throw first, second last year in the world under 20 championships with a Jamaican junior record 20.58. And uh, his form with uh, senior men's shot put suggests that a big throw might be coming. In this event, as in his high school champs, the discus comes first. So he's not quite as fresh as he might be had the schedule been the other way around. Shot put on the 20 boys. Final coming up. Andre Smichael, British Virgin Islands. Shaquan Dunn, the Disco Silver Medalist, Jamaica. Antoine Walkin, 